Good morning. Hello. It's below freezing out. We are going to do a long ride up towards the Croton Dam. And I thought today would be the best time to talk to you about cold weather gear. But first, I got to fix a slow leak here. So let's get on that. All right, I got the bike all loaded up. Let's get out of here. I'm from California and this winter riding thing still puzzles me. Shorter days, colder temps, and a lack of outdoor activities bring on serious seasonal depression. So much so that I ran experiments and shared my thoughts in a previous video. I've been battling winter since I moved to New York, but I think I finally figured out how to stay warm and continue riding all winter long. My weak spots, like most, are hands and feet. As soon as my hands start to feel cold, my drive to keep pedaling is lost. I start thinking of excuses to take the next turn, to flip around, or cut the ride shorter. So it's warmed up a little bit since we started the ride. It is now 27 degrees instead of 24. It's feeling a lot warmer. Oh, yeah. Bar mitts. Now this isn't some new invention but I started noticing them on food delivery guys here in New York. They're not the best looking piece of gear, but these things are the key to keeping your hands warm. They're made of neoprene, which easily keeps out the wind, the water, and also keeps in the heat your hands create. For hours on the bike and below freezing temperatures, my go-to combo is bar mitts with the Giro Pivot 2.0 gloves. These gloves are only rated to about 40 to 50 degrees, but they're waterproof. And they're thin compared to winter gloves, which makes it easy to fill your bars and gives you the confidence to slide in and out of the bar mitts. All right, we're about to cross the biggest frozen lake in all of the land. Look at them go. Oh. <laughs> I tried to slide it out. Our first casual. Oh no! I've tried all the tricks for keeping my feet warm: plastic bags, shoe covers, aluminum foil. I found that none of these methods work for me when trying to stay on the bike for over two hours. <laughs> I finally spent the cash and bought some winter specific riding shoes, the Physique X5 Arcticas. I put some Giro shoe covers over them and my feet stayed warm for the entire five hours and it was below freezing. The covers also kept my new shoes clean and free of all the winter sludge. Obviously I wear base layers, I have uh, winter bibs, jackets, and neck gaiters. But these two items by far are the things that keep me on my bike the longest. Let me know if you have any tricks or tips to keep you riding all winter long. Until then, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.